Now we are getting into the second chapter of this Adbhut Ramayana and here he says I'll chant the uh, uh, maybe two of them. Uh, Dvitiya Sargaha Bharadwaja Shrunushvatha Ramachandrasya Dhimataha Janmana Karanam Vipra Ekshvaku Kulavaridhau Sitayascha Mahadevyaha Prithivyam Janmahe Tukam Tatra Ramakatha Madhau Vakshami Munipungava In the first two verses he says that Hey Vipra Bhadwaj, who is saying, who is telling the story, remember? <laughs> no, Bhadwaj asked, Valmiki is telling the story, Valmiki ji, Rishi Valmiki is telling the story and Bhadwaj ji is the listener and Valmiki ji is saying that, hey Vipra, Vipra means the, uh, the learned one, uh, hey Vipra, Bhadwaj, uh, you listen to the story of the birth of uh, Sri Ramchandra ji who was born in the Ikshvat, Ikshvaku Kula uh, and then he says and and also Mahadevi Sita uh, 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 birth story you listen from me uh, uh, how she took birth on the earth oh great uh, Rishi oh, before telling the Sita story, I'll tell you Ramchandra ji's story. Continuing, he says, Shru yatam munishardula ambarisha kathalayam purushottama mahatmyam sarva papaharam param trishankor daita bharya sarva lakshana shobhita ambarisha sya janani Nityam Shaucha Samanvita. In the third and the fourth verse, he says that, O oh great Muni, Ambarish Katha, <coughs> listen to this Ambarish Katha by listening to this story of Ambarish, uh, King Ambarish. All the papas, all the sins from your life are removed by listening to this story. Uh, and and uh, yeah, and what why it, uh, removes all the papas or the sins because the mahatma of the purushottama the supreme narayan the supreme person his mahatma mahatma is the greatness of the supreme person is expounded in these verses <coughs> there was a person a king by the name of trishanku and he had a uh, his dear wife uh, was, they have not given the name of the wife, but he say, they say <laughs> that uh, and she, she was uh, full of good character and all the Lakshanas were good, etc. Uh, Trishanku and this Trishanku is himself Ambarish and this wife of, uh, no, 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 not wife, what am I saying? This mother of Ambarish, this lady was, Trishanku's wife was the mother of Ambarish. So she was full of good qualities and uh, she was Pativrata and she had all the capabilities and abilities to run, to do whatever is required to be done as a uh, queen and a wife. In this way, in the fifth verse he says, Yog, 
योग निद्रा सामूम शेषपर्यकिन नारायण महात्मा ब्रह्मांडकमलोद्भव तमसा कालरुद्राख्यम रजसा कनकांडज सत्न सर्व विष्णु सर्वदेव नमस्कृत Here in the fifth and the sixth verse, he says that ah, who is that who has created this whole Brahman? He is Narayan, and who is this Narayan? This Narayan is continuously uh, in the uh, position of yoga, in the asan of yoga nidra. He is sleeping all that, lying down. Yoga nidra is not sleep like ours. it is wakeful sleep that is called yoga nidra so he is in yoga nidra and he is sleeping on the shesh shayya and uh, uh, and that person who is who you know as sleeping on the sheshnag uh, uh, he is called as narayan and he is the creator of the brahman <coughs> he alone when he is when He is expressing through tamogun. He is known as Kala Rudra. When he is expressing through Rajogun, he is known as Brahma Ji. When he is expressing through Satvogun, he is known as the the uh, Vishnu. Uh, and who is this Vishnu? He is the all pervasive one. And and he is the one who is continuously being prayed to and uh, the receiving the namaskars of all the devatas. And and he only is uh, and how they are doing namaskar to this great vishnu uh, by manasa vacha and kaya these are the three ways we do kriya activity is done thought activity speech activity and uh, uh, body activity so in all the three ways they are continuously doing the namaskar to our vishnu bhagwan then he says अर्चयामास सतत वन कायवृत्ति मल्यादादिक स्वयं व्यचीकत गंधादिपेषण चूपद्रव्यादिक तथा तत्सर्व कौतुका विष्टा स्वयं चकार सा इन देंथ एंड एट्थ वर्सेस Uh, the wife of or the mother of ambarish or the wife of the trishanku we know trishanku as who in our story ramayana trishanku is he who was sent to heaven created by vishwamitra satyavrat ha huh? na so if it is the same one i don't know but if that mention comes afterwards we'll see but his wife ha huh? he built the three cities in this heaven vishwamitra built from his own tapasya because swarg this because what was his he said he tricked actually he went to vashisht vashisht says i will not do it because nobody can go with the body to heaven then he went to his son he says you get away from here i'll i'll curse you <laughs> he when he heard like this he went to vishwamitra he said you know i went to vashisht and vashisht and his son they both are uh, they say that they are so great and they got so many powers chabi bhari huh and they did not uh, why can't someone go with the body to the heaven and to chadane ke baad vishwamitra i will send you to it and, and then vishwamitra was also uh, anti any uh, anti and he wish wish competition yeah. and uh, he utilizes all his energy to create the heaven but yeah. eventually brahma ji comes and says don't build a parallel creation it will the whole universe will get affected so he stops so he is hanging anyway so his wife name is name is not told she used to do continuous archana and puja and with the flowers and garlands etc and gandh you know the the shodashukchar puja gandh and abhushan and dhup deep and all these various ascetic actions and she never did it out of chale yaar time pass karna hai to karte hain karna hai nahi she used to do it with inspiration 
she enjoyed doing it and and she never uh, used to do it, make someone else do it call a pujari say do the puja and she will just what the world will she do she will watch tv i ek bar bataya tha main gujarat mein kisi ke ghar gaya tha i had gone and uh, every morning three days i was there with them three nights before going to girnar to my tapas uh, sadhana so there in a the very rich house very very multi millionaires and they get up early in the morning no shower nothing brush kiya aake pehle breakfast khaya gujju people सीधे ब्रेकफास्ट खाया नहाया भी नहीं अभी तक तो तो गया भी नहीं किचन में दे सैट डाउन द मदर एंड द ग्रैंड मदर दे सैट डाउन ऑन द चेयर एंड सुबह सुबह वो पीपल यू नो पंडित जी इज टेलिंग यू द भविष्य ऑफ द ऑफ दैट डे वॉट टाइम यू शुड गेट आउट ऑफ द हाउस वॉट टाइम यू शुड डू दिस इन दैट इन द वाइल दे आर वॉचिंग दैट देन द सीरियल्स बिगैन देन इन द मेन टाइम पंडित जी केम माँ जी आज किसकी पूजा करनी है आपको तो पता है सारा सामान हाँ वो नौकर लेके आ रहा है माला वाला सब लेके आ रहा है एंड इज अ ब्यूटिफुल रूम विद ब्यूटिफुल मकराना मार्बल स्टैचूज ऑफ ऑल द गॉड गॉडेज राधा रानी राम लक्ष्मण सीता हनुमान एक्सेट्रा शिव जी पार्वती एंड ही डज वॉट आर दे डूइंग वॉचिंग सीरियल जस्ट आउटसाइड द मंदिर एंड ही इज इन साइड एंड डूइंग द पूजा अच्छा फिर बीच में जब सीरियल चल रहा था तो उसने घंटी बजाई टंग 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 अरे आवाज कम करो हमारे को सुनाई नहीं दे रहा दिस इज हाइट ऑफ प्रोस्पेरिटी हाइट ऑफ प्रोस्पेरिटी सो शी वॉज नॉट लाइक दैट शी यूज टू डू एवरीथिंग बाय हर सेल्फ विद इंस्पिरेशन एंड हा <laughs> and this auspicious woman she she used to continuously hold different vratas you know the kya bolte hain fasts etc for the narayana for the padmavati and and for the anant and, and she used to take all their names the wife's names the the lakshmi's name the narayana's name the uh, ananta means अपने शेषनाग उनके 108 नाम सबकी अर्चना करती थी सबका नाम लेती थी एंड इन दिस वे नाइन्थ एंड टेंथ वर्ष से दैट नाइन्थ हाँ शुभ पद्मावती नित्यम वचो नारायणे तिच अनंते तिच सा नित्यम भाषमाणा यत व्रता तो इन सब के नाम लेती थी पद्मावती के पद्मावती अनदर नेम फॉर कहाँ पे देखा हमने पद्मावती टेम्पल पद्मावती इज द टेम्पल एट द फुट हिल्स ऑफ तिरुपति इज अर्निंग ऑल द वेल्थ एंड गिविंग इट टू हर पेइंग द लोन क्लियरिंग द लोन so that is the padmavati temple so he is she is narayana's wife another name yeah. padma lotus vati the one who is sitting on the lotus ha yeah. to so in this manner <coughs> ah yada vrata uske baad <coughs> kahte the like this she continued doing her uh, sadhana दश वर्ष सहस्रा तत्परेणातरात्म अर्चयामास गोविंद गंधपुष्पादिशुभ विष्णुभक्ता महाभागापिवर्जिता दानमाच नैर्नित्यम धनैरत्नैरतोषयत सो इन दीज टू वर्सेस इन द टेन्थ एंड द इलेवेन्थ वर्स ईशी से After ten thousand years, uh, she for for ten thousand years she kept with inspiration invoking, taking the names, doing the puja of Padmavati, Narayana, and the Ananta, the Sheshnag, and in this way and joyfully. 
and as a result she was completely cleared of all her sins and and all the uh, 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 and not only doing the puja but every day she used to invite all the vishnu bhaktas and give them daan maan means respect them do their puja uh, and give them the uh, uh, enough wealth so that they never have to go and beg for anything but mahatmas are like that if they get enough money now they'll spend it tomorrow and again become <laughs> empty they don't keep anything and in this way she, uh, she 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 herself by doing all these activities remained content she didn't feel that uh, she is doing anything less a balanced life mm -hmm. every day doing her puja archa every day giving daan uh, and dakshina to the mahatmas and as a result of all this what happens next तत देर फोर तत कदाचित सा देवी द्वादश्याम समुप समुपे पोष्य वही हरे रग्रे महाभागा सुश्वापतिना सह त्र नारायणो देव ताह पुषोत्तम किमच्छ शिवर भद्रे मत्थ कि ब्रूहि भामिनी भगवान के अवतरण हो गया तो क्या बोलते हैं कहा था ये ट्वेल्थ इन द ट्वेल्थ वर्स शी सेज ए वन डे ऑन द डे ऑफ द्वादशी ट्वेल्थ डे ऑफ द इंक्रीजिंग मून शी हैड टेकन द वाव एंड अपने अलोंग विद हर हजबेंड दैट त्रिशंकु शी वॉज स्टैंडिंग इन फ्रंट शी वॉज फेसिंग नारायण she was sitting with her eyes closed here it is told here the words are used a bit different it says sushwapa <coughs> so she was sleeping kabhi kabhi ho jata hai bhagwan ka naam lete lete neend aa jati hai so she was sleeping facing narayana and as a result what happened but remember 10000 years she has done the tapasya of continuously joyfully motive inspiringly doing the puja and and at that moment when she was in that tandri in that uh, sleep like state it's called tandri uh, that purushottam the lord nara narayana told her what did he say he said hey bhadre who oh auspicious one what boon do you wish to have from me <laughs> see so when we do tapasya dekho hum bhi jab sadhna karte the karte kya abhi bhi karte hi hain but one day when i was sitting in my meditation pehle om ka uchcharan sunai diya teen din uske baad aakashvani hui kya shastra padho shastra padho shastra padho three times it came from where it came I was just chanting the name of the Lord. That's all. And within six months, I was in the ashram. Exactly like that. This is I I can relate to it because I have gone through something like that. Huh? But इसके लिए क्या करना है? Mind should be single pointed. Single pointed, not on the world. On what? On the Lord. Then it happens. The inner direction comes. So. to the exclusion of everything else ananya ashchanta indoma so lord narayana told her asked her that he bhadre kaha gaya ha ya ha ha tatra narayano devah tamah purushottamah kimachasi varam bhadre o oh, auspicious one Kim ichchasi, what do you desire from me? Tell me what boon do you want? Badre matta kim bruhi bahamini. Uh, what is that boon which is uh, for for which you are doing all? I am adding words here that you are doing all this tapasya. I am when Lord comes to you, He is only coming by His own will, not because you have called Him. He has come out of His own free will. And he, when does He come? 
what did we see when ram chandra ji comes what do we need two things pure mind and pure intellect isn't it there what was the intellect kaushalya is the intellect pure mind dasharat now in this woman the mother mother of, of ambarish or wife of trishanku something the mind and intellect have purified to a large extent and in that maybe when you are if she is not completely empty maybe some desire must be there <coughs> you'll find out what it is so the lord came and he is asking because she is purified therefore he came otherwise he, uh, he will not come to any tom dick and harry just like that ya to ravan bano ya ram bano so dono taraf se ram bhagwan aate hain to then what does she say she says kimbrohi bhavini सा दृष्ट्वा तंबर वव्रे पुत्रस्वक्ति भवे सार्वभो भौम महातेजा स्वकर्म निरत शुचि तथे ददौत फलमेक जनादन सा प्रबुद्धा फल दृष्ट्वा भर्तरे सर्व निवेद्य हाउ ब्यूटिफुल एंड देन शी सेज इन द Thirteenth, ah, uh, in the uh, the moment this uh, wife of Trishanku, she had the darshan of uh, Narayana and heard that this is all happening in Avidai's clothes. This is happening in the mind. Many people have. Amma saw some light. She saw some kumbh. Ah, uh, achhe. You saw saw bade swami ji. The, the these these are all auspicious things. डोंट गेट अटैच टू इट उस समय जो हो गया हो गया इफ योर माइंड इज प्योर यू विल नॉट आस्क फॉर एनी थिंग इफ योर माइंड इज इम्प्योर यू विल आस्क फॉर समथिंग सो येस शी हैज डन लॉट ऑफ तपस्या टेन थाउजेंड ईयर्स बट शी हैज अ डिजायर वील फाइंड आउट वॉट दैट डिजायर इज वेर एज अवर वो कौन थी यार जो रामचंद्र जी को बेर खिलाती थी शबरी शी हैड नो डिजायर शी हैड नो डिजायर रामचंद्र जी आज वॉट यू आर नथिंग शी जस्ट केप्ट एंड ही हिमसेल्फ आउट ऑफ हिज ओन लव फॉर हर सींग दैट शी डजेंट वॉन्ट एनी थिंग टोल्ड हर द नवविधा भक्ति एंड वेन ही कंप्लीटेड द नवविधा भक्ति शी ड्रॉप्ट हर बॉडी एंड मर्ज इन टू द डिवाइन एट दैट ओल्ड लेडी सी सो हियर she has a desire therefore she is getting akashvani hmm? so what, what does she say uh, 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 after having the darshan of uh, lord narayana she, she asked for a, uh, uh, a boon and she that <clears throat> i want someone who has great bhakti towards you uh, he is uh, uh, all pervasive yeah, he is mahatejasvi he he is ever doing what is required to be done in his own his own duty he is ever doing it and as a such a pure soul i want as my child <laughs> as my son she says putra i want a, such a person as my uh, son at that time here the word uh, is not used at narayana they use janardan janardan bhagwan meaning narayan bhagwan he said tathastu so be it and uh, he gave her one fruit to eat and seeing that fruit uh, uh, in her hand uh, suddenly she woke up and when she woke up the fruit was there in her hand so was it a dream or was it a real Uh, and she woke up and all she took that and went and told her husband trishanku that this is how i was dreaming and suddenly the fruit i found in my hand see i'll tell you one one person one boy used to stay with us and he had a interview in wick roads and uh, as a management trainee he finished from deakin university and he had a uh, he was in accounts and he had gone to the city and he didn't know where to go and what not and he was running late and no taxi was waiting and 
he told me after a few years, not straight away, and he prayed, Bhagwan, if I miss this interview, what must be from deep in his heart, he must have called out. Suddenly, one taxi came and stood in front of him, driven by a black man, uh, African. Hey, you want to go somewhere? He said, yeah, I want to go to this, this place. I don't know where to go, which tram goes, which train goes. Can you, uh, uh, can you take me? Come, sit down quickly, get in. And when he sat down in the taxi, he said, don't worry. I know why you are going. You will get the job. <laughs> <laughs> he went, dropped him in front of the recruit. That time it used to be in the uh, uh, Burke Street somewhere near that. Went there. He got out, purse is usually in the back pocket. He got out, he looked like this, put his hand in, turned around, there is no taxi. He didn't even hear the taxi going. There was no taxi. <laughs> so, I say, miracles in Melbourne. Mein bhi hote hai. <laughs> so, for uske liye, apne ko patra banana padta hai. So, uh, <clears throat> she told everything to her husband. Now, in the 16th verse, Bhakshaya, ha, Bhakshaya masa sandashya phalam tad dhrushtama nasa tata kale nasa devi putram kula vivardhanam Asuyata Kshubhacharam Vasudeva Parayanam Shubhalakshana Sampannam Vakrankita Manuttamam In the 16th and 17th verse, she, he says, uh, the Valmiki ji is telling, with this, with the, when she got that fruit after she told her husband, that lady, that wife of Trishanku, with a very happy disposition, with a very joyous mind, she took that prasad, that fruit which had been, which was in her hand, and joyfully enjoyed and took that, took part, took that prasad, and uh, uh, and at a, after having had the prasad, after a particular time, when the time was right, uh, a, a, a child was born in her family uh, through her. Uh, who is going to bring glory to her, her dynasty, the Kula. Uh, and <clears throat> and uh, the child was beautiful, with beautiful character, and he was a great devotee of uh, Vasudev, and uh, he was full of good qualities and Lakshanas. Ch Lakshanas, kya hote hain? Uh, you know, usually if you see Satya Sai Baba or Krishna, some, some places you must have seen, when they see, you see the footprint, there are six different markings. There is a Shankha, there is a Chakra, there is yeah. a, a arrow or a bow, some th different things are there. So, so the, with all Shubha Lakshanas, he was born with Chakra, chakra Chinna. Huh? This, um, this boy was born with Chakra Chinna. Chakra is the Sudarshan Chakra. And uh, she gave birth to such a wonderful child. <coughs> and uh, Jatam Drishtva Pita Putram Kriya Sarvash Chakaravai Ambarisha Itikhyato Loke Sambhava Samabhavat Prabhu Patir Pitar Yuparate Shriman Abhishikto Mahatma Bihi Mantrishwadhaya Rajyamcha Tapa Ugram Chakara Saha. In the 18th and 19th verse, he says, uh, Valmiki ji says, uh, after the boy was born, the child was born, the father, who is this the father? Trishanku. Trishanku did all that was required to be done in the dharmic manner. What is to be done? वो सब जो भी क्रिया होती हैं नाम करण होता है अन्न प्राक्षण होता है जो भी नित्य कर्म होते हैं ना वो सब नैमित्य का कर्म वो सब किए उन्होंने he did all that and and that child was named as 
Ambarish and he became or here it is said he became famous in all the three worlds by the name of Ambarish. In the 19th verse he says after the father had passed away uh, the, all the Mahatmas, the, all the saints and sages of that uh, in that land, uh, they took uh, Ambarish and they did the uh, crowning ceremony for him, and and then uh, handing over that child to the various kings and the prime, not kings, the ministers and the prime minister, etc. Uh, they went away to do their own. Uh, संवत्सर सहस्रम वै जन जगन्नारायण प्रभु हृत्पुंडरीक मध्यस्थम सूर्यमंडल मध्यगम शंख चक्र गदा पद्म धारय चतुर्भुज शुद्ध जाबून निभम ब्रह्म विष्णु शिवात्मक in the 20th and 21st verse uh, he says actually till 22nd sarva bharana sanyuktam pitambara dharam prabhum shri vatsa vakshasam devam purusham purushottamam in these three verses uh, valmiki ji is telling that for thousands uh, for thousand years he uh, uh, established uh, uh, he established the Narayan Bhagwan. which Narayan Bhagwan? who is this we are talking about Ambarish for thousand years in his Hridaya Kamal in the lotus of his heart in the uh, in the uh, uh, what do you call uh, in the in the brightness of his heart not in a dark heart in the brightness of the heart whom did he keep their fixated and remain fixated on it, Narayan Bhagwan. Which Narayan Bhagwan? Shankar Chakra Gada Padma Dhari. So here it says, Shankar Chakra Gada Padma, uh, that, that Saumya Roop, that beautiful countenance of the Lord, and he had the four hands, and, <clears throat> and he had long hair, and a beautiful smile, and um, he was, that form is equivalent to or in more than Brahma, Vishnu, Mahesh put together and he was uh, beautifully adorned with all the ornaments and what are the ornaments that Narayan is wearing? He is wearing a kamarband, armband, wristband, uh, 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 what do you call? Rings. Uh, rings. Uh, he has got the uh, uh, ankle, anklets and malas and uh, 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 makara kundal etc and the crown on top uh, all this uh, all this is not given there i am just saying but here he is seeing yeah he says brahma sarva all the abhushanas are there and pitambar dhari he is wearing a pitambar means a yellow dhotar and and on his vakshasthal the shrivatsa the shrivatsa is what where lakshmi ji is virajman and how do you know it is vaksha he has three and a one white hair going three and a half times round on his chest, on, on top of his heart. And Vakshastal, three words, uh, uh, that sign is there. And uh, such a Purushottama, such a Narayan, he men kept meditating on for thousand years. Or hum? <laughs> Tuesday to Tuesday. <laughs> तथो गुडमाहूय सर्वेवैरभीषुत आज गामस विश्वात्मोकनमस्कृत ऐरावतमेवांचिम वै गुडम हरि स्वयं शक्र इवासी नमाह नृपसतम इन द ट्वेंटी थर्ड एंड ट्वेंटी फोर्थ वर्स हि सेज दैट uh -huh. the one uh, whose tuti all the gods are doing and uh, uh, the entire universe and all or we should say all the 14 lokas uh, 
are uh, surrendered at the feet of, at whose feet they are surrendered uh, that uh, that great uh, narayana that supreme narayana that purushottam narayana he sat, got on to the garud and uh, uh, came to ambarish see this is also another remember gajendra moksh mm -hmm. who came narayan bhagwan on garuda isn't it when that uh, uh, you know that story that uh, uh, what i can't remember the name of the story but in that one brahmin he was uh, and he got attracted by a tribal girl and wanted to do some bhog and then eventually he leaves uh, uh, his family leaves his uh, ajamil. Huh? ajamil 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 so he leaves everyone he leaves his teaching he leaves his scriptures because of the lust for the woman and has so many children and uh, last one by mistake he names him narayan <laughs> And when he is dying, he call, he is, loves the youngest one the most, and he calls out Narayan, Narayan. But instead of the Lord, uh, uh, Nar Lord Narayana's uh, Parshadas come, and they are also of the same uh, form. Uh, so we see that happen, and and here uh, it is told that. After so many thousand years of tapasya and remembering the Lord Narayana in his heart, the, the Lord Narayana himself sat on the Garud and came. Then, <coughs> ah, and how did he come? That unthinkable Paramatma made Garud into Ayravat. Now understand, Paramatma is everywhere. Narayana is everything. So he is Indra also. He is all the Ash, uh, 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 the Ayravat also. He is the Garud also. Everything he is. So he made Garud into Ayravat and himself he became the Indra and he sat on it and he came to the the great king, Nrupashresht, to the, the best among the kings. And he came and he started speaking to him. And what did he speak? He started saying, Indroham asmi bhadram te kim dadami tavadyavai sarva lokeshwaroham tvam rakshitum samupa gataha ambarishastutam drishtva shakramai ravatasthitam uvachavachanam dhiman Vishnu Bhakti Parayanaha. In the 25th and 26th verse, he says, Bhagwan came, he has taken the form because Bhagwan himself has become Indra, Bhagwan himself has become Surya, Bhagwan himself has become all the various gods that you know. And the Shakti, she has become all the different goddesses that we know. So here, Ambarish Jitni Usne Sadhna Kiye, according to that, he is coming. So he says, well, the moment he appears, he says, I am, I am Indra and may, the, may the auspicious befall upon you and I have come to give you a Vardhan, I have come to give you a boon. I have come to protect you in this entire universe. That's why I have come. Yeah? Here, the verse, what did the verse say? The verse said, Sarva Lokeshwaro Ham Twam Rakshitum Samupagata I have come to protect you from the entire universe, all the lokas. Nobody in these lokas can maybe something must be happening because as you grow in your sadhana, it's all the lokas are where? Are they outside? They are in your mind only. Ravan is also in your mind, Naraji is also in your mind, Narayan. Bhagwan is also there, all the various lokas, the devas, the gandharvas, the indras, everyone is there only. And as you do your sadhana, they come and test you. They come and check you out. Are you, are you qualified to move to the next level? So if in our life, if any challenges are coming, they are only coming to test us. Are we ready for the next level of success? 
और आर वी गोइंग टू बी स्टिल कंप्लेनिंग दाल में नमक कम है और ककड़ी थोड़ी ककड़ी कड़ है चाइनी मिली आगे वो आगे कैसे बढ़ेंगे इफ यू आर स्टिल स्टक हियर हाउ विल बी ग्रो फर्दर तो हियर आई एम टेलिंग द होल प्रिंसिपल ऑफ इट दिस इज जस्ट जोकिंगली बट दिस इज हाउ द साधना है उस समय घबराना नहीं है तो हियर ही सेज आई हैव कम टू प्रोटेक्ट यू एंड अम्बिर अम्बिर अम्बर ही शस्तु तम दृष्टवा एंड अम्बरीश having seen this uh, uh seeing seen what seeing uh, uh indra sitting on the airavat because airavat is the vehicle of indra bhagwan <coughs> excuse me uh and that buddhiman that intelligent ambrish who is this intelligent ambrish He, and why he is being called intelligent buddhiman because he has done the bhakti of narayana and when your mind is single pointed on the lord automatically intelligence comes to you now let's see if he succumbs to the boon or he asks for something else i don't know he what does he say very nice but let's see the sanskrit first he says न अहम तवाम अभिसंधाय तप आस्थितवाह तया दत्त न चेच्छा गच्छ शक्र यथा सुखम मम नारायणो नाथ तवाम न तो श्येम राधिप वृजेन्द्र मृथावस्त्र मश्रम विलोपनम वेरी इंटेलिजेंट हि इज अ डिवोटी ऑफ नारायण एंड हू हेज कम टू हिम इंद्र what does he say that i did not do this tapasya of remembering lord narayana in my heart to get, receive blessings from you <laughs> i didn't do bless do the tapasya and the breath of 1000 years to have your darshan maine aapke liye nahi kiya tab then kya i don't want anything that you can give me this is the power who is indra in us Who is Indra in us? Sun. Sun is Surya. How can he be Indra? Huh? No, that is Surya and Chandra. Mind. The Lord of the mind is Indra. And mind can give you anything, anything. And mind comes to sit for something. Uh, uh, I am very tired. And अच्छा चलो घर वापस होटल चलते हैं. बस में से उतरते ही नो no, अभी तो एनर्जी बहुत है शॉपिंग करनी है दिस इज दिस इज माइंड दिस इज माइंड सो माइंड कैन गिव यू द स्मॉलर देन द स्मॉलेस्ट बिगर देन द बिगेस्ट क्वेश्चन इज आर यू फोकस्ड ऑन इट बट हु इज नारायण इज ही इन द माइंड और इज ही बियॉन्ड द माइंड बियॉन्ड द माइंड so he says see now this is this is lessons for us this is not just a story remember he is telling the story from spiritual bent how we can improve how we can grow so that the lord narayana comes and takes us over narayan ka bhut chad jana chahiye ya ram ka bhut chad jana chahiye he says <coughs> that i have not in that any tapasya to invoke you and I don't want anything that you can give me. Nachiket also, when he was Nachiket, a eight years old child was there. He went to the Lord of Death. Bhagwan ne ka, I'll give you apsaras, I'll give you palaces, I'll give you lordship over the three worlds, and many other things, armies. Now Nachiket said, that is all okay, but all this will it give me that? knowledge by knowing which nothing more needs to be known see aise aise apna our mind must get molded in this manner and there in that story in that upanishad the guru yamraj he is so thrilled with that answer of his student 
that he and he admits that when i was your age i also wanted to know i want to i also wanted to be all powerful i wanted to conquer death nachiket is also conquering death he has come to death but i was so i wanted to know the truth but somewhere i got distracted and i became i asked when narayana came and he asked me what do you want and i instead of saying i want you i said i want lordship over death so i became yamaraj sab ki apni apni position hai na is it now i'm stuck i have the knowledge but i'm stuck in my job description so he says i don't want anything from you o in a o indra aap you came by your own free will you you are free to go away also by your own free will See? you came by your own free will i didn't call you you came you can go also because i don't want anything from you then my lord my swami is narayan himself and he is the god of all gods <clears throat> i have not done this tapasya uh, to satisfy you i have done this tapasya to invoke narayana so please you can aprasthan kijiye you go your way <laughs> If, to say this and not be afraid of indra if you get little bit afraid in saying this you have a doubt in your mind that ye kya ho gaya mere ko mere ko ye sapna kya aa gaya aise sach hai ke jhoot hai little bit doubt push the mind will take over indra will take over indra will create problem but when you see this fellow is steadfast this fellow is unafraid he has got no fear in his heart he is completely committed to the narayana who is my boss also he cannot do anything to him but if there is even one doubt in the mind of amrish he will challenge him this is how our mind functions so here he, he, without anything hey oh indra you please go your way uh you, by staying in this ashram you are only wasting my time and taking my time away from my contemplation on lord narayana dekho itni taakat honi chahiye you must have that strength <laughs> i now remember it was lord narayana alone who has taken the form of indra and come no wo to test karne ke liye aaye the to yahan pe batate hain kahan pe hmm तत प्रहस्य भगवान स्वरूपमको धरी शांगचक्र गाणी शंखहस्तो जनादन गरुड़ोपरी विश्वात्मा नीलाचल इवापर देवगंधर्वसंघ स्तूयमान सतत इन दर्टी नाइन्थ थर्टी वर्ष Uh, that time when he said like this lord vishnu he he gave a smile and he means indra gave a smile and we can't say indra narayana gave a smile and he left the form of indra and came into his original form where he is holding the shankha chakra gada padma and uh, uh, and gave him the darshan uh, and this vishwatma vishnu he is sitting on the the on the garud and he is a beautiful the body is blue and he is looking very beautiful and all all around him on in all the four sides all the dev gandhar devas and the gandharvas uh, they are singing his glory because he has come to do some uh, to bless uh, ambrish and uh, uh, they are saying you know, Uh, what do they say in the thirty-first? 
जिसे प्रणम्य राजा संतुष्ट तुष्टाव गरुध्वज प्रसीद लोकनाथ स्व मम नाथ जनादन कृष्ण कृष्ण जगन्नाथ सर्वोक नमस्कृत तमादिस्व अनादिस्व अनंत पुरुष प्रभु दिस इज द प्रेयर ऑफ द मे बी आगे भी है शायद हाँ आगे भी है अप्रमेय विभुर्ष्णु गोविंद कमलेक्षण महेशराज महेशरांशो मध्य पुष्क खगम खग एनी वेट गोज ऑन आई विल कम बैक टू इट टिल थर्टी थ्री थर्टी वन मीस इज ऑल द गॉड्स एंड द गंधर्वास दे वेर प्रेइंग टू प्रेइंग टू लॉर्ड नारायण एट and having this darshan of uh, narayana sitting on the garud with all the gods and gandharvas around him and singing uh, uh, the, the singing his stuti uh, the, the king ambarish he uh, he did his pranams and he started uh, pray, making saying a prayer automatically it uh, got invoked out of him and and he said oh oh lokanath oh 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 best or of uh, oh oh lord of the whole uh, all the lokas or the whole world oh janardana you be happy with me you may you shower your blessings upon me and what does he say he says hey krishna hey krishna hey jagannath सर कृष्ण ऑल्सो यू आर जगन्नाथ ऑल्सो आर यू आर सर्व लोक ऑल द लोकाज ऑल्सो यू आर सी हाउ इज जस्ट बाय कॉन्टम्पलेटिंग ऑन द नारायण इन हिज हार्ट हिज विजन इज एक्सपैंडेड ही इज सींग द नारायण एवरी वेर ही नोज इट ही मे नॉट हैव एक्सपीरियंसड इट बट ही नोज इट दैट यू आर परवेडिंग ऑल द लोकाज एंड you are the unborn you are the anaditvam and uh, uh, you are anantatvam you are a purushottama and you are the lord of everything that uh, that is there and also you are aprameya uh, you are vibhu you are vishnu you are govinda you are kamala lochana you are maheshwara uh, a part of maheshwara uh, and the uh, and यर द वर्ड यूज इज मध्य पुष्कर तथा एंड ऑल्सो यू आर द वन हु मूव्स अराउंड इन द इन द स्पेस विदाउट मूविंग एनी वेयर दिस इज द ब्यूटी ऑफ द सुप्रीम एंड देन द नेक्स्ट वर्स वर् कव्यवाह कपालीव हव्यवाह प्रभंजन आदिदेव क्रियानंद परमात्म संस्थि ताम प्रपन्नोस्मि गोविंद पाही मां पुष्क क्षण नान्या गतिस्वन्यामे शरण गंड सेंड हिज ही कंटिन्ूज हिज प्रेयर टू एम हिज हेज यू आर द ग्रेटेस्ट पोएट यू आर द कपाली यू आर द हव्यवाह एंड यू आर प्रभंजन अब इसके आपको मीनिंग पता है इन वर्ड्स के हव्यवाह एंड प्रभंजन एनी वे वी कैन फाइंड आउट हाँ एंड यू आर आदिदेव यू आर डूइंग ऑल द एक्टिविटीज विथ जॉय एंड ब्लिस एंड यू आर एवर You are ever uh, staying in the Paramatma as the Paramatma. See, what is the difference between Paramatma and Ishwar? Ishwar, Ishwar. Paramatma is the truth. Ishwar is the uh, you ask anything from Ishwar. Paramatma, you cannot ask. Paramatma is the truth. You have to. Yes, Paramatma you. is one without a second. That Paramatma alone expresses as Ishwar and Prakriti, ठीक है? 
So Narayana cannot be without Lakshmi. She says, Mahalakshmi is always sitting at his feet. That is his Shakti. Ram cannot be without Sita. Brahmaji cannot be without Saraswati. Shivji cannot be without Parvati. So Shakti has a... So Paramatma, when he desires, he becomes or he takes the form of Ishwara and Prakriti. When Ishwara and Prakriti come together, in the presence of Ishwara, Prakriti becomes activated. That first activation gives rise to Sattva Rajas Tamas. As Sattva, we told before, he is called Vishnu and Lakshmi. Vishnu is the Purusha, Lakshmi is the Shakti. Then as Rajas, Brahmaji is the Purusha, Saraswati is the Shakti. And in Tamas, Maheshwar or Shivji is the Purusha and Parvati is the Shakti. And then after that comes the space, air, fire, water, earth and all the devtas, etc, etc. And in this way, he says, you are Adi Deva, you are the God of all gods and all the activities, joyous activities are located in you and, and you are, you know that you are the Paramatma, you are one without a second. This is the beauty. Our Mahatma, saints and sages, they have realized the truth. They know that they are the infinite one, yet they are behaving as if they are human with us. They are taking satsangs, they are giving uh, lectures on Gita, Ramayana, Upanishads, etc., etc., moving around with the people. But they know that they are the Paramatma. And in this way, saying this, we conclude in the, in the, he says, Hey, O oh Govind, where are we? In the 35th verse. Tvam prapannosmi Govinda pahi maam puskare kshana nanya gati stvadanyame tvam eva sharanam gataha. He says, he says, O oh, hey Govind, I have come at your feet. Mai aapki sharan mein aya hu. Hey, O oh Kamal Nayan, O oh Lotus Eyed One, please protect me. Other than you, nobody else can protect me. No other God can protect me other than you. Uh, and without you, I cannot reach the destination. Without you, I cannot reach the destination. What is the destination? You decide. But I cannot reach my destination without your support. And, and therefore, I have come at your feet. And th at that time, Bhagwan Vishnu, when he says like this, he asks him, you want me to continue or we stop? It's, we'll stop. Because now Vishnu Bhagwan is asking, what is that destination you want to go to? What is that you want protection from me and we will look at that verse in our tomorrow morning's class. 36th Yadar. 36. 36. So, now we are slowly, now what do you want? What do you want? I don't know. I have read a lot of years ago. I have read a lot of stories. Om Purnamada Purnamidam Purnat Purnamudachyate Purnasya Purnamadaya Purnameva Vashishyate Om Shanti 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 Hari Om Shri Guru Pyo Namaha Hari Om Just sit quietly for a moment. Bring the Lord in your heart. Think about him, contemplate on him with love. And when you see him in the heart, how does the love express? You see him as if, not as a murti, but as a living person. To see him as a living person, you need to see that he is a Chaitanya Murti, not a Jad Murti. 
तो देखो कि उनके बाल हिल रहे हैं उनका पीताम्बर फड़फड़ा रहा है हवा में दैट इज कॉलिंग यू आउट 